Today we're over here at my Japanese koi pond. And more importantly, our shipment of Japanese koi fish just arrived. What the heck? What are you? Let me sneak it. What, 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 what you guys doing in there? Huh? You having a little party? So these right here are the three boxes of Japanese koi fish. Side note, I also have more koi coming from Japan. This is just the first shipment. All right, let's bring these boxes to the pond. Oh my goodness. Some big old koi. Oh. Oh. Oh crap, y'all film that? Damn, that's a thick old koi fish. What in the, is this, is this thing recording? Oh, oh, oh crap. Look what we got here. Let's unbox these babies. What's in the box? Holy crap, what the? Don't worry baby, daddy's coming. Oh, I farted. If you don't know, now you know, koi fish. Because the water's cold, we gotta acclimate them. <laughs> you, oh, oh my goodness, they're so gorgeous. Oh, oh, goodness. Goodness. Oh. These fish are perfect. And then on top of that, they're only Time two years this. old. What? And this is the start of my little koi business. Oh my goodness, look at that. Now these koi fish right here are some of the best koi fish from what breeders you may ask. Everybody knows Yamabuki Ogon. The best breeder in all of Niigata is Izumiya Koi Farm. We just got over to Izumiya Koi Farm and we're actually gonna let the breeder pick out Lemon, our brand new koi fish. So one of these beautiful awesome fish that are obviously yellow are gonna be ours. Hi Lemon. So there is a couple in here. This is the only one that's coming back to the Rolf family. Her name is Lemon. <laughs> Her name is Lemon. She is a Yamabuki Ogon and uh, whew, she's coming back to the Rolf fam. Come here, you wanna get like real up close, like some shots, look at her scales. See how perfect her scales are? This right here is two different koi fish. One is a Yamabuki Ogon from Izumiya Koi Firm. Her name is Lemon. And the other one is a Shiro Suri. And uh, her name is Panda. So this is the fish we're talking about. This is a Shiro Suri and her name is Panda. Look at this beautiful girl. Hi Panda, hi. Oh my goodness. So Panda is a beautiful female koi. One day she could have a bunch of beautiful little baby pandas back at the Raw Fam, but if you look at her, woo, look how happy she is. She is so exciting. Look at this. So, this is Panda, and guys, let's welcome Panda to the Raw Fam, cuz I just bought her. Let's cut the bags open and measure them. Oh. All right, we're opening them up. See this? This Shiro Suri? Gorgeous. Gosh. Look how gorgeous they are. Beautiful. Relax, relax, relax. This fish right here is 56. She's probably about 55, 56 centimeters. And then look at this. Look at Panda. Come down here. Look at Panda. Yeah, 57. So Panda's actually 57, almost 58 centimeters. Set her up. Welcome to the pond, Panda. Yeah, that's sick. This right here is probably about a $2,000 to $2,500 fish. Nope, not happening. Beautiful. All right, Raw fam, so we heard a couple miss that Atsuka. S-U-K-A. Atsuka. Yes. That Atsuka actually has Ninja, the fish that we've been after. Wow, guys, look at that. That is my beautiful brand new koi ninja. She is gonna come back to the Raw fam and she is gonna be bouncing, jumping around that koi pond, having an amazing time. And his name, Raw fam? John C. Is Ninja. You're trash, kid. There we go. Right in there. Oh my god, look at this fish. Oh my goodness. 
guys, Ninja is jet black. Holy crap. But more importantly, how long is Ninja? She is 70 centimeters, Brawl fam. And that means she's 27 and a half inches. This is Ninja, our new koi. She is completely gorgeous. She is all black and she is ready to go in her pond. She needs to gain about 25 centimeters and then she needs to start going and filling out and she'll be a $15,000, $20,000 koi fish one day. There she goes, there she goes. All right, we got some more koi fish. So instead of two times fast, now we gotta go three times as fast. Beautiful. Nice. So we actually have three really cool, unique varieties in here. All right, we're gonna start with this Hiatsuri. Look at this thing. Everybody say hello to Tigger, just like Winnie the Pooh, my beautiful brand new koi fish. Come on. She is so beautiful, and um, she just looks like a tiger. You could call her Tiger. I'm gonna call her Tigger because I used to watch Winnie the Pooh when I was a little kid, and uh, just look at her. So what you're gonna look for when you're looking for these fish is you're gonna look for a black head, and it kind of has the Showa pattern. So you're gonna get that T, so beautiful, but most importantly, the full black fins. is gorgeous Hiatsuri from Shinoda Koi Farm. Beautiful, and that is, I'll just say 49 centimeters, right? Beautiful. Mm. Probably a $2,000 fish to a $3,500 fish, so we're gonna go right in the middle and say this fish right here is $2,500. This fish right here is absolutely gorgeous. It's gonna get massive, it's just on the smaller side for a two-year-old fish. This right here is by far one of my favorite fish in the entire pond, and her name is Tigger. <laughs> Can you see that? Look, she looks like uh, like Tigger from Winnie the Pooh. She's gorgeous. All right, let's pick her up. Look at this fish raw fam. This girl is so beautiful. Every fish inside this pond, by the way, is a female. Wow. Tim, how many years of experience do you have doing this? This is my 30th year. So I think we've came to the right place. As you can see, if you look literally anywhere around here, there's uh, hundreds of All Japan Koi Show awards. So clearly this guy is the real deal when it comes to breeding koi fish. That one right there? Yeah, that one's nice. We'll see that one just, oh, there you go. So we literally tore this koi farm apart. We look through this bowl right here. We look through this bowl right here. We even look through this bowl right here. But when I tell you we're perfectionists, come here guys. Let me show you guys my new koi Yeti. Here we go guys, come here. Hi Yeti. So this koi right here is a platinum Ogon with Fukurin scales. This koi is a freaking gem and we literally picked through this entire koi farm. So who knows, maybe this thing will win the All Japan Koi Show one day. I don't know, but this koi is so beautiful and she's coming home to the raw fam. Hey, welcome to the raw fam, my new koi fish, Yeti. 43 centimeters, guys. All right, guys, so this koi fish that we're about to put in is Yeti. He's gonna be gorgeous, come over here. Hi, peaches. Krashigoi get this like beautiful, beautiful like pink color and it kind of reminds me of peaches and that's why we're gonna be getting this peach colored Karashigoi. <laughs> now Karashigoi are known for being one of the biggest koi breeds in the entire world. Some Karashigoi are getting 120 centimeters. That's over a meter long. So Rolf Fam, it's a done deal. Deutsch Karashigoi right here, going back to the Rolf Fam. Perfect, we got him. We're gonna see how big she is. 49 centimeter koi fish. 49 centimeter koi fish, guys. This is actually a Karashigoi, and Karashigoi get freaking massive. This fish will be one of the biggest fish in the entire pond. 
a very, very, very popular Bud line, but it's a Deutz Krasigoy, so probably like at a thousand dollars right there. Ready? Uh, five peaches. So we're taking a small break to just let you guys know that every single koi that you see us buying inside of this video is like kind of like an investment in myself and in just in the hobby in general. Like for instance, you see this koi below me? Any of these fish right here can be worth between five and probably $20,000. So every single fish that you see us buy in today's video is for my personal collection, but one day will be an Oya koi, AKA one koi that I will breed. So pretty lit that we're starting it, AKA right now with you guys, the Rawl fam. And if you haven't already, subscribe, just hit the dang button because this is lit.